Hi, Connie. Okay. Um, over here uh, on our teams, uh, I don't know which one to go first. Let's do the teams. How do I make this yellow? Um, say I am going to put in a new team. We'll put it down here. We'll do uh, team 17. Okay. Well, let me just do it here. We're not playing. We're waiting in case we need to fill in. But uh, I'll play like uh, Laura and I are going to be a team. So that's going to be team 17. If you go up here and you see home, hit home. And you see this little paint bucket thing and it says fill color. You're going to um, hit Team 17. You're going to go up here. If you do the pull down, it will show you your different colors. But I just wanted to highlight it. But you can make it any colors you want. Uh, so we're just doing a highlight. So doing that, whoops, sorry. Doing that on Team 17, you have it blocked. Come up here and just hit that the fill color, the little pouring paint bucket, and there you have Team 17. Now for the lines, I have divided them up. Each one of them uh, are on their own line, but I have put a separate line in here so it divides them. It's easier to read for people. It's easier to see who the teams are and you can follow it all the way across. So doing that, we're going to put a line, see where it says Kim Jones? I'm going to go over here on 35. I'm going to hit that. I here, first of all, I want you to see, see there is no line here, right here. So I'm going to hit 35, where the first one is, right under Kim Jones. Come up here to these little windows. See my pointer? If you bring that down, you can hit a bottom border, a left border, right, no borders, all borders, blah, 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 blah. You can fit, you can pick which one you want. If you want to, you can go ahead and come down and do colors, and you can do uh, how big do you want it, um, the line, the style, all that kind of stuff. I just want a plain old line. So I'm going to do a top border. I have my name highlighted, so in other words, I'm going to do the top of my name. If I had Kim Jones highlighted, I can put one underneath and do the same thing. But we will go ahead, I have this highlighted, you can see it comes all the way across. And we're going to do a top border. In other words, that is going to put a line on top of my name. So you just hit it. And then if I move off of that, see, I now have a line. Say I want a line on the bottom of Laura's. I hit Laura's name. We're going to come up here, bottom border. I hit that. Now, Laura has one in the bottom. So that way it um, separates and by eye, it is just so much easier to read. One other thing is you're doing team tournaments. Um, say, when, when I had the regular, uh, our first layout of who signed up, and we had everybody's names, and we had everybody's uh, starting scores, and I, was, I had it set out from um, low to high or high or low. I don't know what I did, but anyway. And I started moving people around. I started taking one from the bottom and going from the top and vice versa. How I did that was, say you want um, Laura to go to, to move up to my name, okay? You see this? I'm going to put it on this line. You see that little plus sign right there? I'm going to right click. When I right click, I'm going to move up. Let go, put shift 
down, and move. Watch. See? There goes Laura. Again, let me do it one more time for you. You're going to hit this, number 36, that's where Laura is, and I want to move her up. I can move Laura actually all the way up here. Watch, I'll put her up here in team. Hit 36, put your mouse over the line, the top line that you're going to move. Right click and keep your finger down. Keep it down on the mouse. And when you do, it will move with you. Let's put Laura up here. Again, shift, down, and move. Boom. Laura now is in Team 10. Now I'm going to undo it up here on the left because I don't want her up there. But anyway, that's how you can move people around without deleting it and then typing it back in and so forth. So if you know that you have the numbers correct the first time, you don't have to retype them and wonder if you make a mistake. You can just move them up and down and around. Uh, so like yesterday when um, I got, uh, who was it? Um, oh, Margette decided or said that she was going on vacation. She forgot. She had to leave. That was last night. So she left. Gloria signed up, and so what I did, I had taken her out, and I had already put Gloria and, and Annie and Kim and so forth. They were down here waiting on where they're going to and who they're going to play with. So I did the exact same thing. I had Gloria already down here, so I deleted Margette, and I just moved her up to wherever it was. I forgot. Uh, oh, right here. I just moved her up to Team 10. Didn't have to retype it. Nothing. And then when you're through playing around and so forth, all you do is file and always save. I always save. Just to make sure that the computer doesn't go down, I've lost all my dang numbers. Um, anyway, I hope that makes sense. If it doesn't, let me know and I'll do another one.